Hello everyone, this is Rishi Brandon Stafford with ExpeditiousFool.com, putting mindfulness in motion, also founder of Fellowship of Universal Truth Yogic Ministries, and I have another channeled message from Spirit, so let me go ahead and get out of the way. These hands. These are God's hands. Source, goddess, energy, doesn't matter. These are the hands. Not mine. I mean all hands. All hands that look like this are capable. It's whether or not the participant, the rest of the body is willing. Are they willing to put them together and feel unity with everything? Are they willing to put them to use for peace, equanimity, greatness? Are they accountable hands? They hold themselves accountable to do the work. Do they expect it to be done for them? Do they, do they hope and pray that some savior will come? Or do they start saving? It's all on us. It's all on us what we do with these hands, with these mouthpieces, these bodies. It's why the body is the temple. It's how you can worship, by how you live your life, how you make every one of your decisions. There's no need for shame or guilt or any of that silly stuff that a lot of faiths bring in. There's none. There's no need for that. If you haven't been using these hands, though, and you're hearing this message, there's accountability. It's the reason why I make some people grumpy, but I speak the truth. There's accountability when you realize what this body, your life, is really for. It's to serve the highest good. The highest good. Not a mediocre life. Not just getting by not worrying and being in fear. No, the highest good. It's what this whole body was created for. That's the benefit of being a human. That's when you start being a human and stop being an animal, is when you start living your life to make these hands God's hands. All right, everyone, that's the message I have for you today. I hope this helps. I hope it encourages you. Have a great day on purpose and stay mindful. Namaskar.